So recently I was on a phone call and um, this woman paid me a really nice compliment. And I immediately brushed that compliment off. And she said, you know, women have such a hard time accepting compliments. And I acknowledged that that was actually true. And I wanna share with you that for me personally, at least, this seems to have been a pattern that I've had for quite a long time. Uh, a couple years ago, I actually received some business awards. I received a gold um, award for coach of the year and another gold award for video of the year. And it was a big ceremony in New York City and I decided that I couldn't go. Um, instead, I went to a conference and managed my booth. And, you know, it was interesting because that entire conference was a total bust. I mean, it was, it was actually a disaster and we left early. And later, the woman that I sent to New York City said that several other women at the table had handed her their business cards for me to reach out to them and work with them. So actually, if I had just gone and accepted the award, then I would have been in a place where I would have had business coming to me anyway. And, you know, I noticed that this was just a pattern that has happened again and again. You know, I wrote a book and then when the book came out, I didn't really take time to celebrate it. I was always asking myself, what's next? And one of the biggest lessons that I've learned out of that, because of where I'm at right now, is how important it is to just pause, to acknowledge what you have accomplished up to this point. If you get an award to actually hold space and graciously receive that award yourself for the hard work that you've put in. If someone gives you a compliment to receive that compliment. And I do feel that, at least for myself, that's something that I am still working on. I encourage each of you to practice the skill feel your happiness expand and really embrace everything that you are and everything that you have to contribute to this planet. Because I will tell you, if, if you don't do this, um, what I've learned myself is it just leads to a lot of burnout, um, exhaustion, sometimes even resentment. And you really begin to question, gosh, am I on the right path? Am I doing the right thing? And part of that is because you're over giving, you're overdoing. And I'm saying that as somebody who knows all about overgiving and overdoing. And I just want to remind all of us that take that moment and receive all of the wonderful feedback that helps you stay in a place of balance and appreciation and gratitude, not just for the people around you, but also for yourself and your ability and your capacity to share your gifts with the world.